Um, and Ted, I hear you're kind of in the doghouse with Mary. Something to do with your hair. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, it started, uh, it's, I'm up here in Canada right now uh, in quarantine because I came up to visit Mary and I'm, so I'm two weeks into this quarantine. Um, and uh, it, it went back to the first six months of uh, the pandemic when, you know, you didn't get out much and you didn't see anyone. And she offered to give me a haircut and it was looking, it was looking in real need. And I finally agreed to let her cut, yeah, there it is, <laughs> to cut my hair. <laughs> and uh, it was really a good job. And she, but it took about an hour and 40 minutes for the haircut. Um, and she did it for me three times. And then, and then towards about a month ago, uh, somebody who's a friend who, who's actually a professional barber came over to the house and we are outside socially distancing and all of that. But she offered to give me a haircut and I leapt up and went, oh, please, yes, yes, I would love one. And it really, it really hurt Mary's feelings. I mean, she hasn't let it go. <laughs> and I feel terrible. <laughs> Like, what do you mean? Why are you leaping up for joy? Yeah. Um, that's a long time to sit for a haircut, is what I'm saying, though. I'm just, I might be a little Team Ted on this one. <laughs> that's a long time. Well, no, each each hair was beautifully cut. She's an artist. You know, like, yeah. You can't fight art. I got you. I got you.